Hello everyone, welcome back to today's video. Today we are checking out this delete vehicle script and if you don't know what delete vehicle scripts do is they pretty much make it so if you go up to a car and you do slash dev it will go ahead and delete the video. This is going to be a little bit of a fast video mainly because I am taking care of um, a family member who recently had surgery so I'm not going to be able to record for long today. So pretty much all you have to do to download this is go to the resource in the top of the description and download the latest version which is 1.1.0 and you're just going to go ahead and open this up with however you open up your resources um, when we're WinZip, 7-Zip, whatever you use for it. And you're going to just go ahead and go to wherever your resources folder is. In my case, it's server data dash resources. Um, but in a bunch of different servers and stuff, it's just going to be wherever you have your de default uh, managers, like your system managers, local gameplay game modes, wherever you keep these. And what you're going to do is you're just going to go ahead and drag in the full folder into the resources folder. And what you're going to do is instead of renaming it, you're just going to click right name, click and click rename, but copy the name of it. Just make sure you have the exact name of the folder. Don't change it. Just keep it the same. Go back to your server.cfg file and edit it with notepad or notepad plus plus and then at the top where you see these resources will start by default at the bottom of the list just add ensure or start depending on whatever you use the name of the folder in this case it's wk underscore delete vehicle then we're going to go ahead and start our server and in order to see if it started correctly you're just going to check here and look for the delete vehicle and it started successfully we're good so let's go ahead and hop in game check it out and um we can see how this works all right, so we are in game here, and if I go ahead and just spawn a vehicle, just a random vehicle, and then I go ahead and get out of the vehicle, you can see what's gonna happen if I type slash DV in chat is it's just gonna go ahead and delete the vehicle and say vehicle deleted. Very, very useful if you have role-playing scenes and you don't have an active tow type system on your server. Um, it's just very uh, easy and usable. It works on any car, so you can technically delete any NPC car as well. If you wanted to do a role-play and they're in the middle of the road, or if the NPC ran away or something, you can go ahead and delete all the vehicles. Um, very easy, very, um, pretty much probably the best thing you can possibly do for your server. So I do recommend uh, using it if you need it in your server. Um, there's no permissions or anything. It's usable by all players. So make sure you have um, enough like security on your server that you're not going to have that. But obviously that can be changed just by adding a permission system to the resource if you know how to do that. Anyway, thank you so much for hanging out with me today. We have five PD episodes coming very soon. I can't wait to share it with you and I will see you very soon. Goodbye.